Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Chin back with another video. Today's video is about Donald Trump and this whole COVID-19 thing. But before I get into the video, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this video. So let's get into the video. Every single day. day they get up and you know they're telling us to social distance you know stay home if you're feeling sick wash your hands wear your mask you know just go outside for essentials and stuff like that in order to keep us safe and to keep everyone around us safe and that's understandable they're trying to focus on cutting down the spread of COVID-19 and I'm glad that they're doing that. Now, they're preaching this to us every day. But yet still, apparently, Donald Trump, the president of the also oh loving United States of America, tested positive for COVID-19, whisked away to a hospital, a military hospital where he's been treated for this. But yet still, in less than a week, somebody who is tested positive for COVID-19 is on a motorcade? I don't understand that. And not only that, they're telling us to stay home, stay away from people, social distancing, you know, limit our gatherings and stuff like that. But... He's positive. He has tested positive for COVID-19. And he's locked up in an SUV with his Secret Service agents. So let me ask a question. These Secret Service agents, they don't have families. So it's okay for you to tell us to stay home. But it's okay for you to be po uh, COVID-19 positive. And you're outside, locked up in an SUV with Secret Service agents. So, to me, that seems like you really don't care about... Well, we all know you really don't care about us. You don't care about anybody but yourself. Right? Because if that's the case, you would be isolated. Right? You would be in isolation. You should not be in no car driving around with nobody whether or not they're your security your wife your your mother your sister your brother i don't care who it is these are serious times and if you're sick and you're getting help why are you outside driving around okay you're the president we all understand that we know that but why do you get to be driving around in cars when if anybody else is sick, they have to be isolated. I don't understand. And this just brings me to think that you are a horrible human being. Because obviously, you don't care whether or not these people get sick from you. Who cares whether or not they dress up in PPE or goggles or they could be in a freaking bubble for all I care. Your ass should not be out there in no van or no car, no boat, no motorcycle, nothing with anybody else. You should be self-isolated, right? Your ass should be stayed up in that hospital, wherever the hell they ship you off to, and receive your treatment. If you really are COVID-19 positive, which I highly doubt. I think this is just a sham and maybe I'm crazy but that's just how I feel that's just what I feel about the whole situation I bottom line is I don't think he had COVID-19 to begin with I think as I said this is a freaking scam 
even if he did have it or what I'm thinking say he did have it round it just only says one other thing maybe they do have a cure for this and they're hiding it real question is is there a cure for COVID and they're using it to treat Donald Trump or is he faking this whole COVID positive result? What do you guys think? Again, as I said, this is just my humble opinion. And to think that this man really didn't have COVID or to think that these people had a cure for this thing all this time and are allowing innocent people to die? What kind of person or what kind of people are you guys? Seriously. Again, just my humble opinion. I honestly don't think he had this COVID-19 because as I said, the things that I'm pointing out, Maybe if you guys look into it, maybe, I don't know, maybe it's just me, but this is just how my brain works. Because, again, as I said, not even a week after he was tested positive for COVID, he mysteriously disappeared to some hospital, some military hospital. We heard nothing about his wife's case of COVID, right? Apparently, he was on oxygen. He's off oxygen. Now... He's outside on a motorcade with his secret service agents locked up in an SUV. Yes, they have on protective gears, but really and truly, is that enough? How safe are these things? You know what I mean? So, I don't think he had it. And I'm sure I'm, I'm not the only one that thinks that. But again, it's just my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to like, share, comment.